Hello, welcome back to today's episode of Final Fantasy XII. We got the Sword of Kings last time, we fought one of the judges at Mount Bromaceis, and once again, Ash has denied intervening in this war between Arcadia and Rosaria that might happen at any time when Alcid, Alcid? Asked her to go back with him to Rosaria to try to do something to keep the peace. Instead, she has decided that we're going to take the Sword of Kings north into Arcadian territory so that we can destroy the Dusk Shard so that the Empire can't use it. All right, I hope you guys will enjoy today's episode. Need to head north of Nalbana through the Moss Foreign High Waste and the Silica Wood. All right, so let's see our world map. Okay, so to, if we go to the Ester Sand, then we can hit up, uh, we could probably get to Nal Nalbana that way. Or we could go through the waterway, but I think this will be a more direct approach. The Ester Sand? Is there anything else here that we want to look at? There probably is before we leave Rabinoster. Let's check on our two friends. Here he is. Is this him? Oh, he's by the bridge, right? Yes. Okay. Remember now. Have you heard of King Wraithwall? Oh, this is still the same thing. Little has changed for me. I have seen much of the city, though I still have made few friends and am no closer to realizing my goal. I have not spoken of this to you before, but I came to Rabinoster to become more like my sister. She has grown tired of our life of isolation. Long ago she left, only later did I hear rumors she had come here. All this time, my sister has been making her way through the world while I lived uh, in the sheltered piece of the wood. I would be as she is. Do you think it possible? I don't know your sister. True, you do not. I will tell you of her when the time is right. I do not mean to keep secrets, but I'm not ready to be measured against her, not yet. At first I was wondering if Fran was her sister, but... Fran is with us, and I feel like they would have been like, hey, it's you. Like, Fran's literally, like, you know, walking beside us kind of deal. All right, let's head to the Esther Sand. Should we use this team, or should we use Vaughn's team? I think we should use Vaughn's team. Because Vaughn is the one who, who got destroyed last time. He's level 29. Oh, shoot. I thought he was level 30 something. Oh, we should have fought him sooner. Okay, that's fine. Let's try. Let's see if gravity works on him. Let's experiment a little bit with some of our new stuff. Whoa. That is good. Um. Let's, let's just, let's try to disable him. Oh God, he's, he's dead. <laughs> Revenge! <laughs> Revenge! <laughs> we waited too long. I wanted to have a good fight against him, but he's level 29. <laughs> Whoopsie. You love that I'm playing the game in teams. Really interesting. You should do a run like that. Did you not do it like that? I just feel like it makes sense. It just makes things easier. So like, I had Balthier and Fran switched. Uh, I, I had them on the other teams, but now I switched them. So I'm trying out. 
because I didn't have any ranged person in uh, the other team. Since Fran is a close range. So I had like two, two long range in this party with Balthier and Pinello. So I switched Balthier over. So I have Vaughn as my tank. Um, Pinello's my healer. And then she's like my DPS with her magic and stuff. And then for the other team, I have Bosch as my tank and Ash as the healer and Balthier as like the DPS, but he's more of a physical based DPS and Fraun is more of a magic based DPS. And uh, we'll just see how this works for a while. Okay, so where are we going? Which way? We haven't been up this way. I'm guessing maybe this is where we want to go up north. Yep. All right, let's go. So I did do a few new stuff. I have Vaughn casting haste on everybody. I think that's not going to work out. This MP is going to go down really fast. Yeah. Him casting it on himself. On himself? We'll try it. So I have Phoenix down. Vaughn cast haste on himself. Vaughn cast Libra on himself. Um, I wanted to try balance. Area damage equal to the difference in caster's current and max, max HP. So if his HP gets low-ish, which it shouldn't, normally because I have people healing but if it does happen to get like below 40% then maybe if he uses balance it could do some good damage high potion I have quite a few arrow motes so if an enemy is weak to wind then we can have those get used up a little bit uh three plus froze present disable and immobilize just because I want to utilize those because I probably never will otherwise um I have shades of black on enemies for both on enemies that are weak to certain resist uh elements just maybe uh i don't want him to use it all the time but i want him to use it sometimes so i was just trying to think of a way for him to use it sometimes um let's see what do I, did i change anything on her no i didn't change anything on her if the enemy has reflect she's not going to use any magic she's going to attack them she's going to use oil and fire on fire week and dara blizzara aqua arrow um if his hp gets really low then he'll use Soul Eater. Consume HP to damage one foe. Oh, no, when the foe's HP is really low. So I just thought, like, maybe he could chunk them when they're low with by using Soul Eater. I don't know. <laughs> I just want I just want this stuff to be in here. So she'll use Dispel. She'll use Darkra if three plus foes are present. Water Week, Wind Week, Arrow, and Aqua. And then, of course, she casts Regen, Protect, and Decoy on the party leader. Um, Kiraga, she has... Bosh has Kiraga, too, right? Yeah, Bosh has Kiraga as well. And then Pinello just got a bunch of healing stuff. Kiraga, Regen, Asuna, Decoy Protect on the party leader. I Oh, I was wondering. I was wondering about Shell. So in past games that I played, I think I remember Shell, which increases magic resistance, also increases the resistance to magic, like healing magic. So I don't generally use Shell in like, I think Final Fantasy VII. But if, if I put shell on somebody, does that mean they're going to get healed for less because the magic can't get through the shell? Or is that yes or no is basically what I'm wondering. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm really wary about reflect and shell because I want my I want to be able to use my heals. No idea. All right, well, we'll just leave. We'll just leave it. I don't think shell is going to be a, a make or break for me. I think just protect and regen and keep the heals up on the party leader while they're tanking will probably be good enough. It does not affect healing. It reduces the chance of being inflicted with status ailments by 50%? That's even crazier than the magic damage reduction. Okay, we're going to go ahead and add that in then. Shell. Party leader. That's crazy good. Since my safe time later, leaving out of the northeast exit with the blue arrow that is, isn't labeled. Okay. And we got to take a break. Yeah. Um, 
Um, Vayne has, oh, Vayne, Vaughn has a new weapon. He can't use a shield now, which makes me a little bit nervous since he's my tank, but we could always go back to a normal dagger. He, ha he has this thing that is a special, what is it called again? Ashura, it's a ninja sword and it can do blind on hit, which is cool. We'll try it out. It seems to do quite a bit of damage. Okay, as long as my healer is doing work, as long as Penella's is doing her job, then yeah. Vaughn should be fine. He'll he'll be okay, right? <laughs> he won't die. All right, let's go. Ooh, where are we at? Oh boy. Nalbina Town! I work to earn money to buy my daughter medicine. Please buy something. Oh, jeez. Okay, I think I should buy something. You don't have any weapons or anything. What am I gonna buy? Fine, I'll buy some stuff. That's all I can do for you. Really. I hope that helps your daughter and her medicine. Itinerant hand. Moss Foreign Highway suggests a ways down this road. Make your way across the highway so you'll come out in the Salika Wood. I'm quite fond of the star fruits you can find there. Now that the blockade is down, I'm hoping Adair's caravan will bring some to town. All right, we found a new teleport spot. Many of our young men died defending their homeland in the war two years ago. Right here at Nalbana Fortress, they were slain. Yet now this place is a base for the Arcadian armies. They have gathered labor to fortify the town in preparation for Rosarian attack. There's Gertie. Gertie's cute. Gertie the cutie. Let's explore Nalbana town a bit. Albina Fortress. What a fanciful little tune. Oh, that violin. The horns coming in. I like it. I like it immediately. What a very, uh, flighty little piece, if that makes sense. Is flighty the word to, be, to describe it? I don't know. 
come to help fortify the fortress you shouldn't have you shouldn't have it too bad they say the easy jobs for the hume they save the easy jobs for the humes me i get sent off to do the heavy lifting those imperials think the rest of us are to be used as tools nothing more nice eh i like how complex the this piece of music sounds like there's a lot there's a lot going on a little a lot of little flits and flitters all over the place Nestled as it is on the border of Nebradia and Damasca, Nalbina was always bustling with trade between the two. These days it's more fortress than town. At least it's still here, though. Our home of Nabudis was wiped away from the land, leaving naught but a necrohall of fiends behind. Alright. Ooh, magic! Okay, here we go. I've got the connections that make lesser magickers green. No magic necessary. Take a look at my wares. They speak for themselves. <gasps> oh. I purchased everything already. Dang it. I was hoping he'd have something new. A lot of Imperials buy keepsakes here before heading home. The Viera crafts are particularly popular. Of course, the Seek in black makes some... Heh. Eh. say you know of the back nami a violent greedy lot them back nami hey get out of the back nami i hear they've made the nabrius deadlands their territory that death land is a place fitting for their ilk their ilk technics <laughs> i got a lot of things here None of which I'm at leave to talk about in public, if you know what I mean. <laughs> no. I would know nothing about anything like that. Alright, well, he doesn't have anything new for me either. How very disappointing. I guess we gotta go... We gotta go further out, further north to find some of the good stuff. The Marcadians were all talking, and they didn't look happy. Heard something about the Leviathan and her eighth fleet going down. Took some important judge down with it, too, from the sounds of it. Huh, serves them right. So the two judges that are in our uh, bestiary are the two that have died so far, right? It's the one we just fought, and then the other one is the one that died with the Leviathan, I guess? No entry on the the lady judge though. I forgot her name. They say a horrible creature that lost a war with the gods lurks even now in the Mosforan High Waste. Tis a local legend. Oh Drace, yeah, Drace. Morningstar Gambits. Never should have opened my shop in this heat. Buy something, will ya? Everyone's so like Oh, I'm sorry. I've already bought literally every gambit. I cannot help you. I'm so sorry. I've heard rumors of the creatures that lurk in the lands about Nalbina. Children's tales compared to the legendary fiends of Arcadia. For instance, did you know that a great palace lies buried deep within the earth to the south of the capital? Well, within that palace, there sleeps a terrible worm. Frightening, isn't it? And if it really exists, there's a fight best vo avoided. Let sleeping worms lie, as they say. Did I fight that worm, or is that a different worm? I know I killed a worm, but... Was it in the desert? I don't remember. Or was it under... I don't know. You report any shops you see stolen goods, son. Can you believe I'm here doing this every day? There I was. Part of the Western Armada. Glorious. Victorious. This war better start soon. I want to be a shield for the homeland and a sword striking down those Rosarian barbarians. How could you even wish for war? You're crazy. Hold there. No further, boy. Leave the sweating to the stonemasons, eh? Armors. 
longest serving merchant in Nalbana right here. Love for years and business has better, never been better. Take a look. Uh, yep, it's all low level stuff. Well, Max did say that this is a, a basically an area that you could visit really early on. So it makes sense they wouldn't have some crazy high level stuff. But this is a this cool spot here. Weapons of War. The Imperials have taken a liking to our shop. Business is great. Care for a weapon or two? Uh, no. <laughs> Sorry. I heard a rumor that someone escaped from the dungeons here, but it weren't my friend. See, I'm not really a stonemason. They came with my buddy to get a friend out of the dungeons. Maybe if he comes out on forced labor, we'll get to see him. That'd be nice. Well, this is the place that Bosch escaped from, right? So that's probably who they're talking about. Hey, don't be fooled by appearances. I ain't no Imperial. This armor belongs to the guy next to me. He puts it on me so he can load off, loaf off. It's hot, it's heavy. Okay, so it's tough being an Imperial. I get it, come to think of it. Those judges wear armor too, but they don't complain. Unless they're saying it real quiet like behind those scary masks of theirs. sold a box to an imperial the other day heard he took it with him on some leviath thingy then that up and disappeared wonder where it went to sold a box to an imperial and then he took it up on the leviathan what what is it i'm still on break oh is that it wait no what's up here You're looking for the aerodrome? I'll take you. Civilians are only allowed in sections of the fortress. Okay, let's go check it out. No, no. The mist released when the Imperial fleet exploded. Damage the straw coupeau. This is no simple repair. Oh my, you know. Here to work on the fortress? A word to the wise. Complain over much and you'll be thrown in the dungeons from which there can be no escape. Huh? You heard of someone escaping? Bah, nonsense. I was there. I was there, sir. I'm here, watching these goods for hours. You know, I just noticed a lot of these Imperials are armed. Yeah, observant, right? <laughs> That's my job. <laughs> what? <laughs> of course they're armed. We're here working on the fortress walls, but it's torture in this heat. That's why we're negotiating for better p uh, pay. They say that any who complain will be sent to the dungeons, but that's a bluff. They're in a hurry. They need all the hands they can get. Uh, I hope for your sake that you're right. I'm headed to that port in the east where the sky pirates gather. Once I've earned me a ship, I'll be a sky pirate, free to go where I will. I hear conditions in Rabanaster have improved while I've been here in Nalb Nalbana. Must be on account of that new console. Uh, yeah, that new console's not not as great as you'd like to think he is. All right, I'm ready to go out of here. Okay, I think that's about that's about it.
Alrighty. Let's go north. Moss Foreign High Waste. Morgan, level 31. Oh, you know what? I want to give... What What do you have right now, Pinello? No, I want you to have the... Um... The Tippet. Double experience. Because you're in my lowest level. I think you need some experience here. She's level 31. unless they're immune to it that's pretty crazy I don't maybe it didn't work on him What's this? Don't step on that trap, guys. Oh! <laughs> Pinello triggered the trap. Oh, well, good job. percent chance to blind ha. Ha. oh god what are these guys level 33 humbaba all this. Oh god. Fire elemental. You think we could kill it? It's level 25? Is it still gonna, like, murder us? I mean, at some point, I should be able to fight the elementals, right? Jeez, it has a lot of HP. They're tough. I keep wanting to call Fran, Fran, and Vaughn Van. Oh, we got it. 
than a firestone. path there's so many paths to take let's see where this way goes bother with the birds because I'm gonna have to change to my crossbow and then I just don't feel like doing that right now yeah. I don't think you've ever tried to find one who teaches you the hard way right from the beginning that they were bad news. Yeah. So this... That other T-Rex was just one of these high-level enemies. He was just like... He strayed from where he should be kind of chilling in the low-level area. T-Rex, more like T-Rex! He's able to eat more prey down there, understandable. T-Rex, gotta eat! Should equip the crossbow. There's so many of these flying enemies, and I kind of want to fight them. Which one is it? Oh, I think I just need to optimize because. Oh no! Ashura is now the more powerful one. Let's see. 57, recurve crossbow, long bolts. We'll be a cross crossbow boys. Crossbow boys. Where are we going? We're just going south for no reason. Look at this little oasis. I got a diamond shield. Wonder if that's any good. Level up. Or should I say Frawn? What's this little place? Ooh. Would you like to buy a map? Moss Foreign Highways map. 
Yeah. I don't know why you have that map when you're way the heck down here, but... Maybe the cartographers just have whatever is most... Like, whatever is available. Maybe they don't have specific maps, but... You know what I'm saying? Wait, how do I get... How do I go down here? Hmm? You were wondering what would happen here when... Happen when coming here from the north. Well, it looks like... <laughs> nothing. <laughs> so I guess we're stuck. I guess we gotta go from the... South. We're going on an adventure, guys. That no one asked for. There's a quest you can start in the little outpost on the way. If you talk to Dontro, he'll want you to go to the area you're headed to. Dontro? Dontro? Are you Dontro? I think I can ask you to do cactus flower. Oh, I think I can ask you to do this one last thing for me. That cactus flower. Would you take that to my wife for me? She's in the village north of here. She's been tending to a sick traveler found near this village, and I think she might be able to prepare some medicine from that flower. The village is on the south bank of the Nebra. Oh, and tell them to send someone to relieve me while you're there. Oh, okay. Yep, I can do that. So where is she? Is she in this area that I'm going, or is she in Nalbana Fortress? I gotta suffer on normal speed like you did? That doesn't seem fair. She's in the zone with the teleport crystal? Okay, well that- perfect. That's where we're headed. I knew there was a reason we were coming here. Okay. Here. South Bank Village. Good day to you, traveler. We've little to offer aside from the river herself. You're welcome to rest along her banks as you like. Photographer. I already have all the maps. My husband's been gone to the North Bank for three days and I've not heard a word from him. Would it kill him to send a message? Maybe he's dead. Just saying. Our village straddles the River Nebra. We offer desert travelers passage across but for a small fee the ferry has crossed to the north shore i worry it has gone too long but there's little for us to do but wait errol and nate arl and natho couldn't be truer friends that wolf is like a brother to him they run around playing from dawn to dusk oh yeah look at that that's cute What's keeping the menfolk on the north bank, eh? I can't stand watch on my own here forever. What if brigands made for the village? We wouldn't stand a chance. Shh, quiet. We have a sick traveler sleeping just inside. Collapse not far from the village. I worry it may be too late. Dontro bade you bring this cactus flower? This should help us. Yes, thank you. Take this for your trouble. A bundle of needles. What? What good that gonna do? That's my chocobo just over there. He is a has a fondness for shiny things. Buries everything it can get its beak on. 
most recent victim? All the gil I made in Robin Oster. Down on my luck, you might say. Buy something and help me out. What do you say? Uh. Uh. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. The Nebra is one of the greatest rivers in Dalmasca. She carries strange gifts for those with eyes to look. Discarded trinkets, lost coin purses, even messages in bottles have I found on my daily walks of her banks. Sorry, the ferry's not running right now. My dad took the boat across to the north bank, but he hasn't come back. What's taking so long? So... There was nothing here. I thought we would be able to take the ferry across or something. And like, find out what happened. She has another task for me? Oh yeah, let's do it. There's trouble on the north bank, I'm sure of it. I wish Doster would hear, but I know he can't leave the outpost unwatched. So... Now that I've talked to the people in this village, can I go north and maybe there will be something there? Because it was pretty barren before, you know? Oh, I need to, uh... I need to touch this here crystal, don't I? Do I have to talk to Dontro again? Dontro! Thanks for delivering that flower for me. Did they say when they'd be sending someone down to relieve me? What? They're all up on the north bank? I guess I should expect a replace... Shouldn't respect... Expect a replacement anytime soon. Oh. Aha! I was walking the river bank when I saw it. A boat set adrift from the north bank. Of course, I told everyone as soon as I could. No good can come from this. Yes, it's Ru Ruxel's boat. There's no mistake in it. What in the name of the gods is happening over there? There's trouble on the north bank, I'm sure of it. I wish Dantra were here, but I know he can't leave the post uh, unwatched. This is definitely my dad's boat. But where's my dad? Something bad must have happened. I'm crossing to the north bank to see what's going on. I know how to pilot the boat, and there's no way in waiting around here worrying. Nonsense. Watching your father pilot the boat and doing it yourself are two different things. The river's dangerous, boy. But what if my dad's in trouble? After him, there's no one that even knows how to pilot the boat except me. Yes, but even if you make it across the river, who knows what you'll find once you get- once you're there. I'm sorry, but it's simply too dangerous. But... my dad... What if he went with... Chigir- Chig- Chigri? Chigri. He hunted the flowering cactoid for Dantro. He must know how to defend himself. That is true. What do you say, my boy? Will you do this for our village? Will you go with Chigri to see what happened on the north bank? You gotta go. I'll pilot the boat. What do you say? Hell yeah. Thanks. What are we waiting for? Thank you, boy. Look after Chigri for us. And you, be careful. The river will swallow the lot of you if you're not. So I was supposed to, like, explore up here. Not supposed to, but... This is something that I could have and probably should have explored a lot sooner. Oh my goodness! Look at all those cacti! Look! Over there! Are those cactoids? They must have attacked the north bank! What are we gonna do? Wait! There's my dad! And everyone else, too! I don't like the looks of this one bit. 
Seems like they're holding them hostage. But what cactoids want with hostages? I don't believe it. The cactoids all up and left. Now's our chance to go help my dad. What was that all about? I'm so glad you're all right. We didn't know what happened to you. Quite a tale, that one. And you have some tales of your own piloting the boat all by yourself. I knew you'd got the river in your blood. The others said it was too dangerous, but I knew I could handle it. What about the cactoids? They ran off for good, right? We can only hope so. Still, they're a prickly lot. Can't imagine they'd give up that easily. Whoa, what's that? <laughs> oh boy. That's a big mama. That is the leader of the cactoids. Hey, prickle pants. Who do you think you are kidnapping my dad? Stay back, Chigri. They're just trying to find their son. Uh oh, was it the one I killed? Find their son? You mean they're related? That's right. They're a cactoid family. The eldest son, Dran. Is it Dran or Drawn? Van or Vaughn? Fran or Fran? I don't know anymore! Went missing and they set out to find him. They came to our village along the way. Nothing but bad news, this Dran. He is part of a cactoid clan terrorizing the desert. There's even a bounty on his head. This one here is the matriarch of the family. She's been searching high and low for him, wants to bring him back home and set him straight. But they couldn't find Dran anywhere in Dalmasca. That's why they needed us. She forced us to guide them in the lands beyond the desert. Oh God. Um, I think we killed Dran. <laughs> The Mosforan Highways, the Silica Wood, even the Necrohole of Nabudi, Nab Nabudis. I'd given up hope of ever making it back. And after that, we still couldn't find him. So they brought us back here for now. But who knows when they'll drag us off again. So there's a bounty on this Dran, huh? You have any idea where he might be? Um... Uh... I don't think he's to the north of the river. We must have looked under every stone between here and Arcadia. As for the south bank, well... We weren't about to leave the cactoids there and get you and the others mixed up in this too. So that's why you set... So that's why you set the boat adrift. Keep him from making the crossing. I never figured on you coming to rescue me. But there's no time for that now. We'll keep him busy while you search the south bank for Dran. Right, leave it to us. Let's get going. Maybe we didn't kill him? I don't know. I've killed a lot of cactoids. I don't understand. Why would the cactoids invade the village? They're harm usually harmless enough. Their son, you say. And we must find him, but the desert is huge. Where would we even begin? Wait. If this cactoid's been causing as much trouble as they say, someone may have posted a bill for him. Unless... The bill Dantro posted. You hunted that cactoid, didn't you? You don't think... Of course. The cactoid you hunted must have been their son. Hunted and made into medicine. We'll never be able to return him now. Yeah, just return the vial of medicine. Here's your son! <laughs> What? The flower? Why, I boiled it and threw it away behind the house. <laughs> oh no. That's all that's left of poor Dran. <laughs> Dran? <laughs> oh dear. Don't tell me. It's a, it's a lie. What? 
The flower grew a new cactus? to another cactoid? They're a strange lot, aren't they? Supposing you'd take it over to the North Bank, do you think they'd accept it as their son? Is it... Is it a different cactus, same flower? I can't believe the cactoids would attack the village. I've never seen anything like it. You found the cactoid! What? You didn't? You hunted the other one. But this one looks just like that one, huh? Well, none of this makes much sense to me, but I guess we don't have much choice, huh? His family is waiting! Oh, so it's not... the same... one. <laughs> but they'll never know the difference, right? They'll never know. Can I do the cactus dance? Yeah. Of course I can. Are they gonna be able to tell? It's not, their son is not quite the same. Is that a Fortnite dance? It should be. Hmm, <laughs> I don't know. You think they're buying it? I want her to just like, look at him and then just like slap him and he just goes flying like, <laughs> You're not my son! <laughs> and then it shows him like bla like flying off into the sunset. Like Team Rocket style. Bing. Look at him go! Guess they're gonna take him in after all. worth it. A thousand gill and a pouch of worm fire shot. <laughs> okay. Uh, well... Now we can go back. Oh, there's we could talk to people in here now. My friend had just been married when this cactoid business separated them. I'm so happy to see them back together. Aww. Hopefully the village will see more travelers again. Travelers bring talk, news from the world beyond the sands. Does it put, put food on our plates? No, but it's pleasant all the same. My friends had just been married when- Wait, what? I just talked to you. Whoops. I like to think of our experience with the cactoids as a positive one. After all, I may never have set foot outside the desert if not for them. Oh yeah, they went on a whole adventure. They went all the way to the... Ar Arcadian border. 
It went farther than we've gone so far. Farther north, I think. I need to make the crossing, but I have it the gill. Charging good money to ride in that dingy, dingy. Just steal my coin and pouch and be done with it. Now that the cactoids are gone, my mom said I can play outside again. Let's cross the river. It's free! Free for me! Well, I wasn't gonna put this, any of this in the YouTube video, but I guess I have to put this quest in there now. <laughs> I have to. It's too good not to. For Groom Wars, talk to the weapon, armor, magic shop owners many times. It varies for each 15 to 30 and check the hunt notice board 40 times sorry we got a little sidetracked this stream but we'll get back to main story next time on monday so just like like this am i doing it right I got the Sage's monograph. Okay, so then I go to... Superior loot from elementals. Oh, great. From beasts and avions. Oh, so it's different. Okay. So this guy gave us scholars. Superior loot from constructs. Superior loot from fiends. Thank you. Goodbye.